I don't need Nate for live, mate. We are live. Look at that. Boom. I don't know when. What's happening, mate? All good? Yeah, yeah, good. How are you doing? I'm good, man. I'm ready for, what is this, day four, day five? I think it's day day four. Yeah, day four, day five morning. Day five. Day five. Yeah. It's all happening. So, yep, got my cheat sheets. This is kind of what it looks like. Let's post it for everybody up here. This is the cheats. Ooh. We're on. We're we're straight up. I mean, we got the men's four by fifty medley relay, and the Lithuanians have scraped into lane eight. And then we got Egypt in lane five. Now that's a <laughs> that's an interesting pull through. Egypt's in lane five. What? They got in what? the head of the United States, which I mean, I didn't watch the prelim, but that, that's a very interesting little mm. story there. I didn't even know they had. Uh, I didn't even know they had four swimmers. I know they got um, El Kamash is in there. There's a, a Sammy in there. Um, right. I'm not sure the other two, obviously, but I guess we'll have a look and see. Well, I got the. Uh, where are you at? Oh, I got the Italians walking out right now. I just had the Norwegians walk out. So. Oh, me uh, too. No, right. Italy walking out. Yeah. yeah, you're. You guys are 15 seconds behind again. Yes. I yes. hate it, dude. I hate it what so much. It? The men's 400 IM. Let me have a look here. Men's 400 IM. Hello. Hello. From Brazil. Yeah. The men's 400 IM is on today. Yes. <clears throat> oh, that's a that's cracking race. That's going to be a good one. That's right towards the end, though. I don't know if I'll be here then. Oh, we got to be here for that one, dude. That's the race. That is the race. Look at it. Sato, four. Foster, five. Smith. Amelia or Rodin. Rosetti. Yeah, Rosetti. I mean, it's all happening. Yeah, that's a, that's one of the better finals too. Wow. Oh yeah. Okay. It's all. I there. was um. I was, I watched the 20, 2010 short course world championships four hundred IM between Ryan Lochte when he broke the world record when he went three fifty five. First, Tyler Clary, who was in the lead like for over half of it. <laughs> And then uh, Ois from Tunisia was in it. He got third. Mm. So was a young Chad Leclo. Yeah, that was right. I think he stopped swimming after that one. He stopped swimming the 400 IM after that. Yeah. Well, I guess he swam it at 2012, didn't he? He ta- he ta- um he talked about it in in the podcast yeah. a little bit. Yeah. All right, here we go. Oh, Shane Cassis. Shane Cassis is going to lead us off here. Beautiful. I guess the U.S. have made some substitutions, hopefully. Yeah, they yeah, got to get here, those Egyptians, man. You got Nick Fink there. Oh, yeah. It's Tom, it's... Tom doing the fly. Who's doing the free? Probably Z- uh, Ryan, maybe? Yeah, yeah oh. Ryan held. U.S. should win this. The race it's finished for me. Don't tell us who won the race. I don't want to know. How's it finished already? We must be it's way behind. Finished? Okay. I wonder if the YouTube is way ahead, like the YouTube stream or the European stream. I think it's just the FINA feed, whatever that is, is way ahead. All right, we're racing. Oh, it it's tight, though. Oh, U.S. are right there. there. Brazil. U.S. right there. Think. Oh, he had a good start. Wow. Oh, it's it's a good race. Oh, good changeover from Tom Shields. There you go. That's an American changeover. <laughs> That's what they practice for. Tom, a little long on the wall. Good underwaters. Oh, crush that. I thought interesting how uh, hmm. um, we were talking about Tom's head position and Santos's head position. You can see it here too in the fifty. He's very flat, like on a platform almost, not diving down. Who's swimming freestyle for Russia? He's having Vlad? a swim. Whoever yeah, that Morozov. is, Morozov. Yeah, Vladdy, baby. Looks Dude, like it. Yeah, Vlad. Vlad just had himself a swim. And what do we wow. have here? 
We have ourselves a dead heat. He beat Ryan Held, did dead he? Dead heat. Dead heat. Dead heat. Come on, Held. Yeah. Come on, buddy. Oh, a tie. We got ourselves a tie. <laughs> but I, I didn't tell realize you what, that. Did you see that? Wow. I tell you what, Vlad threw down there, man. That was that was one of his better swims. <laughs> Ryan Held just throws his arms up. A tie. Like seriously? Yeah, seriously, huh? They're gonna share the podium with Russia, America, and Russia. That's a good one. That's gonna That's be got those COVID regulations. <laughs> That's a good one. Let me pull this up. Vlad twenty point three seven. What? Where was that an individual man? <clears throat> yeah, he just pulled one out. That's what I mean. It was just a, it was a cracking swim. That was a tie. Look at that. Boom. Photo finish. Yeah, that was it. Ryan held 20.52. Lorenzo Zazzeri, 20.29. Wow. Italian, yeah. Jiminy Pizza. I want to see that the one Egyptian again. guy. I know we're way down. 20.4 in the Egyptian guy. Well, who did, who's that? Who, who did that? Egyptian, 20.4. You see, I don't know how concepts. to say that name, but Abdel uh, Sammy. And then we got uh -huh. Nick Fink 25 1 50 breast. That is moving. That's American record. Yep. Beefy T with the 2175. <clears throat> that was the fastest fly split out of mm -hmm. everyone by one one hundredth of a second. Nice job, Tom. You got it. Cass is not breaking 23. That was that was a killer. I don't think he broke 23 uh, in the individual event either, all three times. Hey, I'm Tom Shields from the United States, and I did the 100 fly, and I got a gold medal. There, you go. there he is. Neither the 50. All right. Tommy. Okay. Tommy boy. Uh, we got the women's 2 I am, I believe. Mm hmm. Uh, let's go around the room. Picks here. Kate Kate Douglas is uh, in lane four here. Uh, she, I mean, wait, <laughs> I'm, I'm going with the Chinese girl. Boo! That's a big call, really. I don't know. It's it's a shot in the dark. I think they've been doing pretty well this competition. We'll see. Kayla Sanchez has the world junior record. I didn't even know she swam the 200 I am. Wow. She's not in this one, though, huh? She's, no. no she's not. That's an unfortunate name. Oh, well, I got my UVA shirt oh, on. Oh, we know who, you, who you're rooting for. Yeah. Uh, Kate Douglas is going to be out way too fast. No one's ever going to be able to catch her from there. After no this first 50 no one, fly, just gonna No be, one's ever going to be able to catch her. It's going to be mop-up work. Do, do, do. No problemo. All right. All right. Okay. I got it. Something here too. Yeah, I might be way off of my predictions. Oh, hang on, hang on. Hold the phone. Hold the phone. All right. All right. Here we go. I'm going to give you my prediction here. You ready? Mm -hmm. Give you my prediction for the win. Tyler Fenwick, baby. Gonna give me some swag too. That's my prediction for the win, everybody. Come on, here she comes. Kate Douglas. Kate Douglas. There she is. Yep. Yeah, we went and watched her race. At UVA, she she's tall too, man. They're all tall. These UVA girls are tall. Mm -hmm. They got a really solid group there right now. I think for the last couple of years, it's been building up. Oh man, they won last year. They just won. Yeah. yeah. <clears throat> I didn't know Pickram was swimming at this meet. I guess she is. I thought she went on holiday. Kate Douglas. Okay, what do you got, Kate? Come on, girl. You your team. Another Leander. Swiss school there in lane one, too. A couple of Canadians in here. Korean. A 
Racing. Got to dive in here for us. Yeah. What happened to Nate? We lost him. Put in his prediction, break. then ran away. Kate Douglas is out strong. He was right. She has taken the lead. Who said, oh, no, not again? What is happening? Is there a DQ? Don't tell me there's a DQ. Don't tell me. I don't want to hear about it just yet. I'm watching. Don't get ahead of us. Don't jump ahead of us. Yeah, she's How? out fast, man. Wow. YouTube. Oh, she's out real fast. YouTube TV must be way ahead. Yeah, she looks smooth, clean. Chinese girl is having a good swim there. Yeah, it's going to be a good. I mean, I still think it's going to be. Pickram, close, Pickram, yeah. Pickram can race, man. She's coming. Oh, we got ourselves a race. Yeah, oh, not a breaststroker. Well, maybe. Oh, no, she is. She's oh, she is. Well. She's pulling up. Yeah. yeah that angle was well. weird. I think Kate Douglas is going to have to do some work here in this freestyle to win this one. Because right now, Pickram has sh soared to the lead. Damn. Yeah, her breaststroke is dirty. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Come on. Come on. You got 50 to go. Come yeah, on. Yeah, that's going to be a good one. Oh, oh China. You called China? Wow. That's a, that's a good call right now. Kate Douglas wants some action, though. Come on, Kate. Finish this up. Come on, pick it up. Here we go. Come on, Kate. Come on, Kate. Don't get the silver. Don't get the bronze. Oh, wow. Oh, Pickram's a racer, man. God, I tell you what. Pickram's a racer. What? Damn, how close is this? Dude. Pickram's, how we didn't call it, huh? Pickram's a racer, man. All business, too. Wow. She just gets no, it done. No congrats at the end. It's just a, yep. All business. Sydney Pickram. Hmm? Crushed it. Yeah, the, the moving point for her was that breaststroke for sure. She just worked that third 50. Oh, hello. Do, we got another guest. Oh, what happened? New, new guest. Sydney Pickram crushed <gasps> the field, man. Pickram. <laughs> Dang it. Pickram loves to race, man. I know she does. Tell me. I don't know why I bet against her. The Chinese girl finished that race with her face. What? Details, man. Use your arm. That's what it's for. Oh. She face planted that thing. What? That's oh, my gold. God. That's a gold medal right That's there. Terrible finish. Man, I would have got the, the jackpot there. Yeah. Oh man, tough one on Kate. She took it out though. That's the world junior good... record. Yep. For who? The Chinese girl. Oh, she's she's young. I think she's sixteen, right? Sixteen years old. Oh, that's why she finished with her face. Come on, man. <laughs> Details. Terrible finish. Pickram's just uh, experience, man. That that's just experience. Mm, Red racing, yeah. Pickram's last ten, man, it was was deadly. She just put her head down. Nate, do we have some DQs in the in the relay? Not that I saw, but a few people in the comments section here. No, not officially. Just people chatting. Uh, uh, uh. Get the baby in town, huh? Hey? Yeah, we're running late here, guys. We're running late. <laughs> he's, he's he's doing it all. Love it. Yeah, Pickram, that fifty breast, thirty five five. Fast side of anyone coming through. Oh, the crowd. Look at the crowd. How much energy in the stadium. 
Oh, they get to sign this ball, sign the ball. What is this? I think uh, they're kind of doing the same thing they had for Olympic trials. They sign all the winners get to sign this ball, and um, uh, it looks like a pearl and a clamshell. <laughs> all right. Yeah. Oh, we got the men's hundred free semi. Wow, I didn't even know. Beautiful. Look at this. Got two good races. Okay. Okay, Zach Zach Apple's in this a little zap forty seven zero. God, that's awful. What? Short course. It's slow. Look at the. I mean, fastest qualifies the Canadian at forty six two. Yeah, that's not. Uh... <clears throat> I mean, they might have been holding back this morning. If anything. Yeah, maybe. Probably. Hopefully. Good. Some youngsters, a little Estonian here. Daniel from Estonia. Okay. Oh, there's Zappel. Shaking it out. Come on, Zap. Let's get serious, buddy. Yusuf. Yeah, I'm sure he was probably one of those guys in the relay just a minute ago. I think so, yeah. Chinese. 46.9. Okay. All right. And he looks like he's five years old. <clears throat> yeah. 2004, 17. Wow. The French Zappel. guy's been in a couple of races too, Maxime. Yeah, there's a, lot, him a of them, yeah. there's a lot of relays at this meet, so people mm -hmm. are doubling up a lot. Moresi mm -hmm. swam a lot. Yeah, another Italian. He's good. He, he's been around yeah. for a long time. He's yeah. good. This guy's good. He's big boy too. He looks really tall. Yeah, moresi has been around for a while. All right. Well, this is this is wide open. Let's get rid of this for a second. Got from Aruba there, lane eight. Nicole Schroeders. Yeah, he trains in the state somewhere. I can't remember where. Racing? Are you racing yet? Or are you on the block? Uh, just about a dive in. They're taking their mark, yeah. Who's out in seven here? That's the Estonian kid. He's having a first 25, getting up on the pace. Why not? What is Zappel doing, man? He looks <gasps> awful back there. He's way back. He's got no power in his stroke. It's really unusual for him. I don't know what he's been doing. Zap? Yeah, he's got no power in his stroke. Did he move coaches too recently? Was he no, still at Indiana? He's still at Indiana. I don't know who's coaching him. I don't know what he's doing, but he looks terrible. Oh, he's not catching any water. What did he just go there? Like a 48? I don't know. Marissi, Marissi chopped up wow, the field. Just, with yeah, made them look slow. 45 5. Yeah. Yeah, the Ruben yeah, guy came in third. Did he? Go. Yeah. Good swim. Moresi's going to win this one. Uh, seems seems like he's right there. Yeah, there's no one else in it. I mean, I mean, Ryan exactly. Held's Ryan Held's in it. Yeah, I think uh, Moresi's Moresi's got to be a heavy favorite for this one now. I can't wait to watch this um, young Canadian kid again. Yeah, he had a really good fifty-two, didn't he? He, went... he got third. Or second? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Where did Zappel go here? Zappel went 47-3. That's... I don't know how you turn up to a world championships and go 47-3. Come on, man. Well. Come on, man. He didn't turn up. I guess. He didn't he didn't go to he didn't go to ISL, so that wasn't the excuse. Right. I thought he was like going back to focus on this meet. That's why he didn't go to the ISL. 
It was. He's just having a terrible meet. All right. Heat two. This is my boy, Gabrielle. Sun Wu Wang in lane eight. He's uh he's not gonna yeah, make it because forty seven again. Where is um where's our boy uh, Popovich? He's Did only he in the two, he's only in the oh, two hundred and the four hundred, right? That's right. He didn't swim this. That's right. No pop. How did he end up doing? Did we see? He didn't do well at all in the 200, right? I don't even think he made it through to the final. Yeah, he didn't make it back. He wouldn't have made the 400. The 400 was pretty quick, actually. There's a little bit of heat on that. There's Sun Wu. Yeah, he was 32nd in the 400. He went 346.0, which I think was his best time. Hmm. Stan, look at Stan from the Netherlands. Super cool. There's, there's a couple of young guys around. Who are these guys? Maybe not. Maybe they're not that young. It's been around for a while. Just uh, getting a chance to swim here. That's Gabby. I like uh, Gabriel Santos. Good kid, man. I like him. Ryan. Looks like he just got out of the warm up pool, warm down pool. Oh, he was part of that uh, medley relay, I guess. Yeah. 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 yeah that's right. Here's Joshua. Joshua Leander. He's he's a young kid. He's got a lot of talent. Six foot four. Eighteen. Oh, he, nineteen. Oh, he's, he's, wow. got the, he's got the sleeveless vest underneath. I like that. See that? Kind of style. Kid's got style. Wow. I think he grew up in Trinidad for like the first like ten years of his life or something. Really? Yeah. Yeah, he's a big boy too, the little the Canadian kid. Yeah, six for four. Six four. Look at him, he's He's Diesel. <laughs> All right, see so what we got here. The Irish kid is like racing. Opposite. Ireland's having a great meet, dude. Yeah, yeah. Great meet for Ireland on both sides. They're in a lot of finals, a lot of names you never heard of, you know. One of Ron the Held. These oh. Held's taking course. it out. Of course he is. This is my this is my NC State jacket, actually. Oh wow! There you go. So you're Virginia and NC State, huh? Just rep repping everybody this morning. <laughs> well, Ryan Hell's bound to lose then if you're repping repping him. Mm -hmm. Oh, Sun Wu with the back half. Who wants a little Sun Wu for the morning breakfast? Here we go. Oh, oh no, Leando, Leando, all day. Oh, he had a great turn coming yeah. through at the end. Wow. What do you go? What's the time? Down, here? Head 40, down, head down. 46 2. Leander, 46 2. Yeah, he did. Yeah, Maresi's, Maresi's going to win this by half a body length. That's all Maresi. Wow. What are, he was 45 5? Yeah. 45 6. Yeah. Little fatigue there on, uh, on Ryan Held, that last 25. He got he got eaten up. Very short on the right side, not getting his hip over. Ugh. 
He's, he's, he can clean it up. What did yeah. he go leading off the relay? 45-7. Yeah, that's, woo, that's, I mean, that's, right that's where he needs to be. Yeah, well, 46-3. It's not it. Let's see who makes top eight here. Who's got top eight? So we got, uh, oh, the Irishman. The Irishman makes top eight. Made it. Oh, awesome. <laughs> Sun Wu. Zapple out. Okay. Yeah, marissi has got a. This is his one to lose, I think. Yeah, Marissi can't lose this. One. It's just no. it's, he's he's uh, so far ahead of everybody. Too strong, too big, too strong. Look how fast Held's out. Twenty-one-seven. Hey, went out like a went out for it. It's putting the heat on that. Maybe a little bit too much heated that one. All right, what else is this morning? Coming up, we got women's hundred <coughs> semifinal, the men's fifty fly final, mm. fifty free semis, men's fifty breaststroke semis, women's backstroke fifty backstroke semis. I mean, I'm that's a finale. Sorry, uh, we got fifty fifty fifties. And then you got 50 your fly, 50 right back, here. 50 breast, 50 free. We got all, we got them all. There's a lot, a lot of swims. Um, I hope, I hope I can make it to this 4 a.m. and then I'm, I'm dipping out after that. I'm Why did it. Clement not swim this event? Uh, that's a great question. Good question. Yeah, Kleshnikov could have, could have killed that. Hmm. Got ourselves a break. I guess they get the uh, medley relay. Yeah, we need some. We got anything we can show in the break here, Nate? You got anything backed up there? We got all sorts of stuff in here. Give us something we can we can watch. What have we got? Good morning. I, like I said, I watched you from a distance at that championships and I could tell there was something different going on with you there and you were ready to perform and you did. You end up getting the bronze medal in the 50 freestyle at the world championships. Yeah, I know. 2151. But I think that was a culmination of um, constantly sharpening my skills during the World Cup. I had this rivalry with Anthony Irvin, and we were swimming very fast, many swims below 21 short course meters. And, um, you know, I'm always learning from my mistakes, and that really helped me. And um, coming into 2013, I think my technique was the best it had ever been. I was mm -hmm. the strongest I had ever been. And um, funnily enough, um, the heats of the 50 freestyle was my first 50 freestyle of the year. Semifinals was my second and the final was my third. Wow. <laughs> I was like 15th after the heats, um, eighth or yes, eighth after the semis. So- um, Wow. Did you know in the final that, that things were clicking for you, that, that you were doing something special in the final? Yes, um, I was learning to pace the 50, if you can believe it. Talk to me about that. What do you mean? I think, um, you know, coming from an IM and more of a distance background, I don't think I was naturally as speedy as some of these other people. I had to work to be fast. I had to put mm -hmm. a lot of power into it. Mm -hmm. And if we think of the 50 freestyle in terms of like a graph, the best 50 freestyle would be the most area underneath the curve. Now, if you're going to swim your 50 freestyle where you're in top speed at 25 and then a rapid drop off, you have less area under the curve as if you have a nice, smooth, long arc. You might not be as fast as the fastest point, but you're going faster for a much longer period of time. 
And I was starting to swim the 50 freestyle like that. We're actually like in the beginning holding back and um, riding about um, 95% and just using my dive. To, it's like jumping on a bicycle that's already going downhill mm -hmm. and really gradually applying the power to sort of build through 35 into 40 meters and then sustain it and stop it from falling apart in the last 10. Oh, well, very, very good explanation. I like that. Something a little bit different, but people... People want to hear different things, and I think that's a good one. So, mm. yeah, that was a great one too. I remember listening to that one. I thought it was fitting, you know, with all the fifties that we're about to swim. Yeah, hundred percent. Yep, yep. You got to hold back, and uh, you know what? Uh, we had um, we had the world champion Ben Proud on here, basically saying the same thing as well. Yeah, he talked about holding back and being at about nine. I think he said about ninety-eight percent, but um, basically holding back. You got to, you can't force a fifty. I've got a little, uh, a little bio here on Tory Husk, Virginia girl. Um, I'm trying to think of her coach's name. I'm having a blank. Has, uh, what have we got here? What is this? Okay, let's remove that. Has come Evan from Styles. Here. That's what it is. That's hmm. who it is. Evan Styles up there yeah, at Arlington Aquatic been Club. Been uh, Carson has been on the podcast for our Olympic coverage, was it? Hey, I think he called no. the 400 IM with us. After he had just gone far away. That's right. Good timing. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I think so. You're right. Yeah. We'll get him back on though after he wins NCAAs. Let's see. Is that the Irish kid? Yeah. Yeah. He's the one who squeezed in the 100 final there. I think he's nice. seventh or eighth. Yeah. Got to have John Rudd on. And these uh these breaks are are freaking long, aren't they? Are we do we have um do we have one coming out today? A pod? Yeah. Yeah. How how'd you go chopping that up? It's just like a Rolandus. Oh, we're putting Rolandus out today? That's the only one we have, right? No, we had a... Oh, that's right. I didn't even yeah. look at that one. <laughs> I got to fix that one. That, yeah, one's fix got, that one's got like the bad audio, right? Take your time on that one. Fix it up. Yeah, but let's put... um, Let's put uh, drag socks out today. Yeah, that's what I had. Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. Drag socks. Rolandist Jimbutis. Do, do you have a thumbnail? Um, I think he pronounced it Gimbutus. That's how I, I asked him. Gimbutus. Rolandus Gimbutus. Yeah. California yeah. All-American. Created the drag socks. Aquavola. Yeah, those things are great, yeah. Aquavola taking the world by storm. Six we'll have a little, ten. We'll have a little podcast on him. We we competed against each other at a couple Olympics. I had to race the big man. Is he an American guy or no, Lithuanian. Lithuanian? That's okay. I, the name is very familiar. That's why yeah. I remember watching him race. Here we are. Look, Kelsey Dahlia. She's right there. That's who we we got. Kelsey Dahlia on the podcast. We just need to we need to clean it up. We had some issues with the uh, with the wi audio, uh, Wi Fi audio. Yeah, it was. Uh, it, we'll clean it up. We'll fix it up before we release. Kelsey Dahlia. Yeah. <laughs> New world record holder. Actually, you know what? It might be, <laughs> if this is a this is a semi, isn't it? Yeah, semi final. Yeah. So the finals tomorrow. So it might be good to release Kelsey Dahlia tomorrow. The hundred fly final. Whoops. You know what I'm saying? We could do that. I don't think anyone's touching her world record. No, they're not. No one's coming anywhere near it. Oh, actually, Maggie McNeil's in this. She can swim. What did she go? 57? She was cruising this morning. Chilling. She was cruising. 
Oh, she's going to drop. She's going to drop a bomb. I tried to get that Brazilian go to Auburn. Didn't work out. I was going to say this uh, Swiss school just did the uh, <clears throat> just did the 200 IM. I don't know how well yeah. she did, but she was just sitting it to you. Oh, yeah, she was sitting first going in. It's been around forever, 1989, birth date. You don't see too many 80s, you know? No. Um, Claire Curzan and Tori Husk will be uh, side by side here. No, they won't. Aren't they? They're in different semis. Lane four. Is it, am yeah, I not looking at the heat sheet right here? Yeah, you're looking at it wrong. They I both talk. Because Anna and Corey <clears throat> Husk next to each other. Unless she pulled out. No, what are you talking about? They just put the thing up on the screen. Claire Crozan's in lane four. Tori Husk is in the next heat in lane five. Heat sheet's wrong. Yeah, the heat sheet we have pulled up is wrong. Dude, I got it right here in front of me. What are you talking? You sent it to me. <laughs> no, it's pulled up on the screen. I'm looking at it right now. Yeah, well, that's oh, wrong. the one Brett. Yeah, Brett, the, the one, one I got is the one you you sent me. It's correct. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. the one you sent Wait, me is this correct. This is the wrong, completely wrong one. At Giving out some bad information here, man. Oh, man. Yeah, the one you uh, the one you sent me is correct. And we're racing. Who is that out in lane? I mean, is that Claire Crozan? She's smoking this field. Oh, yeah. Crozan out fast. McNeil's out slow. Ooh, what's she doing back there? She must be cruising. In lane seven. Yeah, she's way back. Oh, hang on. Here she comes. Here comes Maggie McNeil. Back half, girl. I see what you're doing. Nice game plan. Wow, what a turn. <clears throat> oh, Maggie McNeil with the back half. Bonanza. No world record, but drops two seconds from the morning. Cruising this morning. Cruising. Claire Crozan, she just goes out like a rocket ship, doesn't she? No hold back. Well, she equaled the World Junior record, so that's interesting. Mm. Hopefully you're not tweeting out the wrong heat sheets, Nate. I could be. <laughs> I think you are. No, I think the link is revising them as they go. Mm. You know, it says revised December twentieth, sixteen nineteen, up in the corner. Mm, people pulling out. How old is Krasam? What is she? Sixteen. Seventeen. Do the math. Seventeen. June. Yeah. Two thousand four. 17. She's uh, committed to Stanford. Stanford girl. Future Stanford girl. Tori Husk's already there. They're going to yeah, see a lot of each thing. other. Maggie McNeil with just the stone cold look at the end. Look at her. I think she's blind, though. Didn't she say she's blind? She can't oh, see yeah. anything. Yeah. Did she go to Michigan? Yes. Yeah. yeah. Okay. She's still there. She's. I think she's a senior. I think she's at LSU. No, no, no. No, she stayed at Michigan. I think she's a senior, though. Yeah, I was going to say, she's still, like, 19, so. Yeah, like, a, a, yeah, I think she's already swum some Girl, college no, meets. Is she not? She's from some college mates. 21. So I have to look up. Yeah, I think it's her senior year. Yeah, she's a senior. Her and her and Tori Haas going out at NCAAs. SB is in the house. Another Irish girl here. Okay. She's 
She's the 400 IM girl too. Ellen Wong. Yeah. Yes. The silver medalist. Farida. Farida made the final. Okay. Oh, semi. Semi final. Egypt. And the Hunter Backstroke champion, Louise Hansen. Doubling up. I don't, I don't know some of these people. A lot of newbies. Tori. Here comes Tori. I think the Italian girl's been around a little bit too, but like you said, some of these competitions without the like the big top people, the sort of third and fourths are getting a chance to compete too. I think I've seen the Italian girl on like World Cup circuits and like watching Mara Nostrum, that kind of stuff. Mm. Here we go. Second semi. Good race here between uh, Tori Husk and Louise Hansen. I mean, Farida's got that first 50, though, so she should be out pretty fast. All right, here we go. Here we go. And racing. Racing. Tori Haas got quick. Got to be how fast to go get that world junior record back. <laughs> no, she's, she's, holding 19, she's 19 now, right? Yeah, she can't get it. Tori Husk, 25-8, under world record split. Wow. Let's see if she can hang on. Damn, yeah. A mm, little long on that wall there. <clears throat> oh, here comes Louise Hansen. Back half in it. Oh, it's all Louise. Oh. You said Shostrom didn't enter this event? She wasn't in this one? No. Yeah. No, not in the Hunter Fly. Nope. Just leaving that to her teammates. And getting the job done so far. Yeah. Well, that world record is not in any threat. We might put our podcast out on the world record holder tomorrow. For that final, yeah. Louise Hansen, 55.8. And then a bunch of 56s. Okay. Okay. I thought Maggie McNeil was out slower than that. She was out slow. I mean, not that slow. I mean, Claire was out so fast, though. Yeah, she went out for it. That's, I think, why it looked, it looked slower than it was. Bosnia, Belarus, Egypt, all getting final swims there. Oh, we got, we got ourselves a men's 50 fly final. We got oh, yeah. the, the dueling world record holders. We got Tom Shields in here. Are you picking America again? I always pick America. <laughs> he just Tom. he just had the fastest split on the relay, 21-7. What are we talking about? We're talking about he needs that again. That's what he needs, 21-7. And I'm hard pressed to go with uh, Santos on this one. Go against him? Like, no, I like him. I mean, I like him. I'm gonna yeah. going old man on this one. Old man river. Let's go, old man. 
Hey, let's go. Let's go the 41 year old. Let's put some cash on him. Come on. Come on, Santos. Although I, I do have a soft spot for Tom. You guys know that. Tom's my yeah, boy, but yeah. wouldn't mind him getting a win. Here we go. Come on, Tommy. Come on, Tommy. Yeah, I mean, if they, I guess if that relays anything to go by on Tom, this is going to be a really good race. He's got that speed. Well, it's just going to come down to the details. Who, who, yeah. you know, it's uh, that ninety-five percent that we're talking about. Anyone forces this one, it's just going to be a mess. You just let this one flow and see what happens. Oh, and the hundred champions in lane six, Matteo Revolta from yep. Italy. Santos everyone has, here. Santos has a dirty start. Major Tom Potter. thinks this is the race of the meet. I don't know. The the miles uh tomorrow for the men. It's a lot to the, come. The mile. Roman Chuck, Paul Trineri, Paul Trineri. Florian Wellbrock. Yeah, good race. This one's this one's a cracker. Here we go. Look at the boys. This is a good race. This is just details. Actually, it would be good if uh, Ben Proud was in this too. That would that would really. Dude, we haven't even mentioned Dylan Carter. He, he had the top time yeah. in the in the first fifty. He's sitting there at the you know twenty two one range right now. He's right there. Yeah. Trinidad. When's the last time Trinidad won a world title? Did George win any short course not, titles? Not a world title, I don't think. All right, here we go. Let's go. They're on the blocks. Let's see what's... Uh, whose nails are they? What? Oh, we're racing, boys. All right, you, you better call it then. I'm, I'm too far behind the I'm just going I'm just going to sit back and watch. I'm going to sit back. I'm going to sit back and watch this one. Someone's forcing it. Oh, we got ourselves an upset, I think. We got ourselves oh, an upset. Is that oh. Revolta? Oh, wow. Daniel? Oh, boys. Oh, hold the phone. Huh? We may have ourselves a 41-year-old world champion. Called it. Woo. Dang, Santos. Damn, that was, that was last five strokes won him that race. Did, didn't it? He just connected. Dude, 41. that second. Santos. I didn't even see who came second and third. Was that a Dylan Carter 2198? Carter went one nine. Good for him. Yeah, dude. Good swim. He's doing that sidekick again. Oh, oh, okay. Let's see what he's doing. He got a nice clean finish, Carter, right at the end. Perfectly timed finish. And Santos had a perfect timing turn as well. Wow. Santos didn't he elected not to get up on the lane line. That's a classic mistake. He should have gone on. Yeah. There. You don't want to pull anything. Look at that. 93, 98. Oh, Shields 22-4. Gosh. Yeah. Lost that edge. Dylan Carter right there, hey? Almost world champion. No, the 41-year-old takes it. Look at that. Good for him. We got to get him on the pod. There he is. His English is great. It's good enough. It's really good. I just watched we'll put it together. Yeah. Look at him. He's jacked too, isn't he? A little bit. Yeah, he's a good man. Good man. Let's send him a little congratulations here, eh? Santos. What is he saying? He's saying I'm 41 and I just beat everybody. That is what he said, basically. Basically. He also thanked all the fans, everyone that was in the crowd.
just crushed everybody. I'd like to watch that again. It's so short, they should just play it twice, maybe three times. He's 50s, you know. Oh, his his diving finish, like he did this like pop. He popped his hips at the end and kind of dove into it. I think that won him the race because he, he got an extra little reach on that pop. Yeah, he, didn't, he threw his whole chest into it. Yeah, he didn't he didn't yeah. dive down, but he dove at it and it was just a classic veteran move. Oops. Oh, good for him. So one more year, huh? And then we're gonna get a Santos World Champion again next year. Are they on again next year? World show course again? So the the long course one, they moved it to next year, I think. It's the I think it's in Beijing. Or Kazan? Cause, oh, I don't know. Uh, it's a, it's like it's only in like three places. So yeah, <laughs> Kazan is one of them, guaranteed. Oh, that's right. I got to run some workouts for Bruno Fratus. Bruno's all fired up now after watching Nick Santos. First thing he texts me is like, "We're gonna kill this week." <laughs> oh yeah, we're gonna kill this week. Well, I got to run some workouts for you, big man. All right, we got um, 50 freestyle coming right up. No break here. Women's? Women's. Semi? Yeah, women's semis. We have ourselves oh. some Sarah. Sarah Sostrom's back. How, how interesting is it, the ISL and then this, the FINA production is just so, so, so different. Mm-hmm. Even the, I mean, one's dark and one's light. <sighs> yeah, World Champs is next year in Fukuoka, Japan. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. May 13th through the 29th. Brett's got some stories from Fukuoka. Sure he does. I like this. Uh, I like this format. It just gives you enough time to digest who's in the race. Like the the ISL, I just can't figure out who's in it. And then all of a sudden I see a winner and boom, it's gone. Like I never, I don't get to appreciate kind of the full extent of the race. This just gives me a little more time, don't you think? Honestly, I just like when it. I like to see the pool lit up. I want to see everything. Yeah, that's like my biggest pet peeve about the ISL is it's so dark. Yeah, it's super. That's dark. why I want it. I want it. I want it. I've said it like seven times. I just want it to be outside. Oh, yeah. that would be an interesting one. Yeah, I want it eighty-five and sunny, with fans in the stands. You know, like a two thousand four Athens Olympics vibe. Exactly. Maybe it should be in Athens in that pool. There you go. Even in I Rome. We always um we always said it was akin to uh the Setacoli in Rome. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Or um yeah, I mean the, the, any of the pools, you know, run around to all the outdoor all the great outdoor pools if you want. I think they're well, rebuilding least, uh, the uh mm -hmm. Hall of Fame pool in Fort Lauderdale, so that would be cool. This uh, semi looks at least pretty stacked. You know, you got your best, pretty much a lot of the top girls in the world in this one. Yeah, for sure. Uh, Kat Vasek from Poland. Beryl Gastadella, Renomi. Renomi. Claire Krasan's in this. Back again. Michelle and Coleman. The, the next heat, Sarah Soystrom, Abby Weitzel. Farida Osmond's in it. Good to see her swimming still. Julia Jensen's been swimming well for Denmark. No, no, per nil. Too much. Did she take a little break? Luma? She was dancing with the stars. That's true. <laughs> she was a celebrity. Okay, here we go. On the blocks here. There's your Aussie Holly Barrett. Uh, Renomi yesterday, uh, that 50 fly, or is it two days ago now? Best time. PB. Oh. Oh, 31, somebody, huh? somebody came off that wall on their back. That's got to be a DQ. Someone was dolphin kicking on their back. You see that? No. Oh, yeah. I saw that. See? Who's, that's Kurzan. That's oh, yeah. That was Kurzan. On her back. You yeah, can't kick on your back. That, though. Wow. The Polish girl. Lost 10. Yeah, dude. People underestimate her. She's really good. Her 50 is ridiculous. 
And I, I mean, think she's a much it. better short course than she is long course. It's 23 4. She just laid one out. Woo! It's good. They just said she's training in Las Vegas. Yeah. She does. Living the hard See, life. on the back. See? They did the they did the replay. They did the slow mo replay there on her back. Oh yeah, she takes a long time to get back onto her stomach. Yeah, that's that's illegal, guys. You can't do that. That's like the Ryan Lochte thing, right? <laughs> yeah. They didn't DQ her. No. They didn't spot it. Underwater cameras. Pull them out. All right, that, that'll be a fun... Um, I guess we'll see who, this second heat, but it's going to be a good final regardless. Mm -hmm. I think you've got a lot of veterans in the, in the um, races too, and that's a big thing, like just in terms of racing details and finishing the race and just racing the race well you know it's good to see that i mean that's literally what george bavel was saying in that clip too right he was like mm -hmm. he was talking about a long course win but he said that he sharpened all of his skills through the world cup swimming the 53 yeah. over and over and over again against anthony irvin and Italy, dude, they might be the strongest country, like, population-wise. They're so good. And they hold on to their talent, too. I think they find them and they they put them in programs and stuff over there. Like, those club system is very good in terms of maintaining their kids and maintaining their swimmers. Yeah, it was, it was interesting. To, um, Coach Andre was on the other day, and, you know, he's from Germany, and... Mm -hmm. He was saying that he didn't think like the coach's education was that great. It made me think about the Jocko podcast because Jocko was like when he was young and he just started coaching Peter Van and Hogenbond. Like coaches weren't even like they weren't even like a full time job over there, you know? Yeah. Um. So things have still like have got a long way to go, even in you know super first world flourishing countries like Germany, right? Mm -hmm. That's very very interesting. I mean, Germany's got a lot of pools. They should be better than they are. That's just my yeah, humble yeah. opinion. I mean, they have, I think they have over a thousand pools. Wow. Which means they're in the top 10 uh, in the whole world. It makes you wonder then, like, how, how they're using their talent and how they're using the resources they have. They probably just are, it's almost like a taken, taking for granted kind of thing, I guess, you know? I, I don't know. Every country's so different, you know, like yeah. with how are they funded? You just said it. Yeah. They fund it through membership or they fund it through like the, you know, the, some, the, the Olympic committee, or they fund it through the country. Who's, who's giving all the money to get this thing rolling? All right. Heat two here. We're off. Abby Weitzel. Here we go. Come on, America. Who's in lane six here? She is smoking the Netherlands. She's That's got, that, uh, she got ripped she on the go. turn though. She can't, she can't turn the Russian. And it's all sweet. Great turn. Yeah. It's all Sweden right now. Sarah coming through. 23-3. That's going to be a race tomorrow. She's a little shorter than her finish, don't you think? Can I touch the little flat there? Yeah. I'll clean it up for tomorrow. She... she she just seems like she doesn't get her full, I don't know, a uh, little flat. Yeah, not too bad. Yeah. Three, three. There you go. There are your top there, huh? 16, top eight. Moving on. 
Claire Curzon getting a second swim there. Easy. So we got two Americans in the 50 freestyle final. Here we go. Oh, there we go. Holly Barrett scrapes in. Oh, yeah. Aussie. Yeah, she was a little flat on the finish. Get some more extension on that tomorrow. She'll drop another 10. There you go. Italy second in the medal. So you're right. They really are having a great meet. But it's, it's not just the meet, though. I mean, they did incredibly well at the ISL. They did incredibly well at Euros. They did incredibly well at the Olympics. They, I just think they're, just, they're a they're a great swimming country. Yeah, we uh, it made me think about it every year in around about this time of year or January, like from about Christmas into the new year. In Johannesburg, there was a, there's an Italian team, and they're mostly open water swimmers, but they would come and and Greg Polcinieri actually would come there sometimes, mm -hmm. and they would do their altitude training in Johannesburg, and I would be swimming there on my own, and they uh the kind of stuff they did and like the detail, the lactate testing, the suited practices, the details and what they were doing were just incredible. I mean, it, it was cra And I can tell why they were so like their teams are so good and they are getting so much better. It's just, I think the coaches have stepped, the coaching has stepped up too. And they really are refining what they're doing and they're making sure the athletes are taken care of and managed and, have the opportunity to go and train and go and race and, and, and do everything, you know? Yeah, you're right. The Italians do get around like that in terms of, uh, you know, you see them everywhere. They, they travel a lot. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they compete in a lot of our open water events in South Africa too. I know they, like some they of the organizers, they, they're there a lot. Yeah, they invest in competition. That's good. That's one way to keep your athletes in in country just make sure you have availability to train and compete no need to go anywhere else we've only had like what one italian on here nasty uh, we had two no no we had oh, um, we had poltronary and no, we had three poltronary no we had four god what am i talking about we've had four so we've had massey poltronary and then we had um our two sprint boys why am I drawing a blank here? Oh, um, me too. 100 freestyler. Both 100 freestyles. Um, world champion. Um, come on, man. Why am I going blank? It's too early in the morning. I need more coffee. Give me some more coffee here. Um, who's that two? Who's that 200 freestyle boys? Um, I can see him, the guy you're talking about, but I just, the name is Luca Dada. Uh, that's Luca Dotto, Luca Dotto is one of them, and then the That's world champ, on. the world champ, he tied with Brent Hayden. Um, God, what's his name? Why am I going blank here? Come on, guys. I'm not even thinking. Actually, my not my mind's not even on. I can't even turn it on for some reason. It just won't go on. Um, world champion, tied with Brent Hayden, 2007. Come on, everyone in the comments, here's a trivia for you trivia. We, oh we got like a trivia Marco was he? breaker no not Marco no no he's not it's old Magnini Filippo Filippo <laughs> Magnini yeah see we've had four we had four yeah, Italians on here how dare you say we've only had one or none? Four. Man, I can't believe it's been four. None of them have been super comfortable about coming on either, but they've all done it, you know, oh, in they, terms of the, the language. They they feel like they can't express themselves the way they want to. Mm. Magnini, yeah, Magnini came on. He was great. He's a superstar. I went to a meet in Italy once. He was hang he was like hanging out like best friends with Giorgio Armani. Him and him and Giorgio were just chilling the whole weekend. Oh, yeah, he was he he was a model for them for yeah. a long time. Yeah. Damn. Not a bad the Italians are so people. cool, dude. They got cool fashion. They got lots of followers on Instagram. 
They're beautiful. The people. language is cool. Yeah, they're just cool. Got great food. Yeah. Yeah. Did Son Yang break the world record in, in that Olympics? Yeah. 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 So, so yeah. he won. I remember. 1431. It, it was out of me like 20 meters. I was, I mean, I was swimming, but I was watching him and it was, it was going really fast. And yeah, that was like, this is, I mean, I'm not focusing on times because I think the most important thing is to win races. I can win with 15 minutes and that's okay for me. But I mean, 1431 is, it's an incredible time. So it's a motivation for me to, to keep training and keep reaching, you know, new levels. Oh, yeah, right. He's a good one. He's a thing in swimming is to win. Oh, that's what he said. Love that's it. all he cares about. He just wants to win. He's a cool dude, man. I like him a lot. Good man. Good dude. Yeah, we've had some Italians on here. We've got to get. I've been trying to get Pellegrini, by the way. If anyone out there thinks that I haven't been trying, I've been trying, okay? Trying many different avenues. I've gone through people to get to her, and I've gone through her to get to, you know, it's like, I just can't, I can't do it. She said, uh, she said it ultimately it's the language barrier, but um, mm. yeah. we'll get her. Can't get her. He was like 20 yeah. meters ahead. I was just swimming. I'm swimming. <sighs> He's I'm so gonna funny. Get, I'm going to get uh, Pellegrini's husband. That's who I'm going to get. Her coach, Matteo. Yeah, Matteo. Right, right. He'd be good. He's got good English. All right, you want another clip here? Yeah, why not? Let's do it. I've got a bit of time. We're going to so. stick with the 50s. In the end of the day, like even times, it's just one thing, but nobody is saying that um, to win the Olympics, you need to, to do my time or faster. It's also, that's what I think swimming is exciting. Times is one thing, but to win a race, it's, you never know what the time has to be swung to win a race. You just have to race. God, we've had some superstars on this show, haven't we? Yeah, I dude, we just play clips. We can I play forget. clips incessantly, like I some forget. of the best clips. You know what you should do is you should do a like end of year YouTube video of all the clips of all the people you had, like a little yeah. montage for the yeah. for the channel. Yeah, you know what that takes. The coolest things. Oh, um, no, that takes a long time. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. So much time. Yeah, plenty. Oh, I'm, Nate's got like children now running around the house, yeah. and like he's got one a business. Not, one not moving. You know, it's all happening. If you got time to do it, Jared, it will be a pleasure. <laughs> no, we need a deadline. Content we do. creation is like under, I just think it's undervalued. But mm -hmm. because it takes so much time, people just don't yeah. understand. We do need a content creator, though. If there's anyone out in the audience who wants to be part of the content creation team, we'd love for you to join us. Men's 50 breast up. I mean, it, it, uh, did you see the, uh, the montage we created for the Texas trip? Yes. That thing yeah. took like, you know, 10 hours, 12 oh, hours yeah. to make. Oh, yeah. That's a bitch. Breaststroke, racing. And that doesn't include grabbing it all, you know, like filming mm -hmm. it all. Yeah, we got so much content. Even those, those little clips you put there just took me back. Great memories. Yeah, there's some classic ones. Who's all right, that? how's Martin Nagy looking? Well, he's, he's looking good. He looks clean. Oh, another Saki. Italian. Saki. Yeah, the Tunisian guy. Turkish uh, guy. Turkey. Turkish, Turkish, yeah. Man, he creamed them. That's second 25. Damn, Saki. 25-5. Yes, dude. He got deked in the 100. Yeah. yeah. Oh, he did? Yeah, this is the... He's built just like... Uh, what's his name? Damn, uh, the world record's only 25-2. He wasn't far off that. Cam the man. He probably threw a couple of fly kicks in there too, didn't he? I'm sure uh, he did. I hope not. That was a Cam. floating suit Those too. Those underwater right? cameras will get him. No, Cam I'm talking about, not Saki. Oh. Saki uh, swims, I think, a lot like uh, Shemanovich. They're both huge. Their yeah, pull yeah. is like the focus. He comes out of the water more. Yeah, he comes up high. He, he's... It kind of like disappeared for like a year. It was swimming some other stuff. He could swim some other stuff. I think he's got some a good fifty like free and a good hundred free too. Really? Yeah. 
That little that little call room back there is a that's a dark little room, isn't it? Well, tunnel for them to you can do it. You could like shank your competitors back there. No one would notice. Yeah, dude, this guy's pretty good. All right, so Saki, um, long course fifty free twenty two one. Damn, long course hundred free forty nine four. Short course fifty free twenty one three hundred forty six six. Solid. And then um, got some other strokes, huh? Fifty eight eight hundred plus. I mean, he, best, he, he, he hasn't been going best times in forever. That's his best I mean, time right there. 2019. 25-2. Saki got DQ'd again? No. Is there a DQ? I hope not. Well, they're taking a while for, to bring them out, so. Someone just said Saki DQ. Motu. Oh, oh come on. No way. They DQ'd him again? Let me see it. Where is it? Show it. Come on. Saki oh, no. got DQ'd. It's up on the it's up on the TV. No. No. What? What's going on out here? What is happening? Damn. DQ oh, people left and right. Can I can I just see it? I want to see him. Oh my god. Where's the DQ? Show us. Dude, we gotta just we gotta call these people up and ask them how they feel. Were you cheating? Right. Were you cheating? Honestly, Saki. you think Saki speaks English? Let's get him. Someone to call him up. Are we gonna get him? Uh, Saki, let's get him. Is anyone listening to the um, coverage instead of us, <laughs> so we can find out if anything actually is gonna happen in terms of that disqualification? Saki. No way. Well, not anymore, Rowdy. That's good. Yeah, they sense. just spoke about it being the second fastest time in the world, but nothing else other than DQ. I haven't said anything about it. This guy's got the best name in swimming, Ollie Coco. Nice. Maybe Shring and Shringle. Ollie Coco. You got Coco and Shring and Shringle next to each other. There we go. Nikolaev. Wow. Nick Fink. Nick Fink giving the little oh, Nick. Yep. Giving the little Gary Hall Jr. out there. Oh, okay. Wolf, wave. Joao. He's having a Nick's having a good meet too, I think. Winning that two hundred breast. You get second or third in the hundred. Yeah, well, hundred was a little disappointing. Yeah, compared to his uh, ISL hundred. But uh, here we go, Shamanovic. Eh? Let's see if we get another deke. What's going on with the deke? He hasn't been deke though. But yeah, Saki, yeah, so similar to Saki, technique wise, like you said. Yeah. I guess we'll see, and he's in lane four as well. Yeah, here's your heat sheet here. You know, like get 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 an official on here. Let me see some underwater footage. Explain to me why this guy got disqualified. You know, yeah, anyone out there an official? All right, here we go on the blocks. He two. I think Shimanovich has got this one, especially now that the it's Turkish guy's out. Yeah. Well, what about Nick Fink, man? He just won the ISL. Yeah, the fastest fifty split in the uh, relay you, earlier. Thought you were going with Americans. Here we are, we're getting off the Americans all of a sudden. He's having a great race, though. That's for sure. Fink. Yeah. America. Shimanovich. Ooh, close. Close. Man, Fink's got a he's moving. Dude, he's like a Get water bug, man. 
Oh. 25.5. That's a good swim, too. Oh, beautiful, dude. 25.5. Gomes uh, from Brazil, he got DQ'd the uh, first time around. Didn't get DQ'd in the prelims. Neither did the Turkish guy. Let's see if he gets DQ'd right here. Manovich, nice slow mo of his stroke there. That's a good looking slow mo. I love the way he pops his hips. Oh, he just pops those hips. Nice. They show the underwater of his kick, and it's like he barely opens his legs, too. I mean, yeah. it's oh, yeah. crazy. He just pushes Fast straight heels. back. Straight back. Tons of drilling for that. Oh, well, there we go. Interesting. Got to get the Turkish guy on. You already follow him. You want to message him? I do. Yeah. This guy's got a lot of followers. 43,000 followers. Jeez. Saki? Yeah. All right. Let me pull up those results. Shymanovic. 25.55. That's a solid swim, man. Yeah, he's looking better. He won that hundred. Now he's unstoppable. This is his. This is his event. I mean, again, fast again to that final under twenty six, twenty six three together. What? Twenty six two. Emery, Emery, yeah, that's him, eh? Yeah, does it for like they're points. showing the uh, the, the breaststroke final semi first one? Mm. Oh, he comes oh, up so hot. What are they? You can't see it from there. Come on, man. So they're saying he's doing a dolphin kick into the finish, like the same that Aaliyah got qual- uh, disqualified for. Really? So I guess they're looking underwater when they're questioning whether he's doing it or not, and then they're confirming uh, it underwater. They're catching the finish. Mm-hmm. Dolphin kicking into the finish. Dude, he... Even Rowdy was just sitting there watching it and going, yeah, I don't see it, but yeah, there's an yeah. underwater camera out there somewhere, and that guy saw it, and he's going to get you every single time. Yep, yep. Yeah, well, show it to us, man. This guy is not coming here to get, get disqualified, disqualified. Yeah. on a butterfly kick. Have there been 20 years of indiscretion with dolphin kicking and breaststroke? Of course there has been. Of course. We all know that. But this guy... Like, he knows the cameras are there. He's been DQ'd every single time. He's not trying to dolphin kick. I don't believe it. Show me the dolphin kick. I didn't see any dolphin kicks. I still want to release the footage. I think you're right. I think what's happening is he's kicking up to hit the wall, and then mm. as after he hits, his feet come down, and then they DQ him. But he's him. finished the race. He's Thank you. Like, That's yeah. what I've been saying the whole entire time. You finish the race, and then it's your feet over. come up. You shouldn't be, yeah. yeah the, race the race is over. Is over. Yeah. He's in the middle of a stroke when he's coming down to touch the wall. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. This rule needs to be revised, whatever it is, because that's just that's just not, not fair yeah. on the guys finishing. No. And at that speed too, like you're coming in at such speed and you hit the wall, you can't you can't stop your body from moving, like just dead pan into the wall. It's he, it just he's doesn't going happen. down, right? Yeah. His legs have to come up. Mm-hmm. Yeah. They can't just, go in, in any other direction. Yeah, it's nuts, man. I'm getting heated. They're taking it too far. They're taking this rule too far. Exactly. Huber, our question. Huber, you, you think? Did you see it? Did you see the dolphin kick, Hubie? Show it to us. Rewind the tape. Screenshot. All right, let's pull up this um, heat sheet again. 
I love this little heat sheet they finally started coming out with this little mini thing. That's what they call it, mini mini start list thing. All right, we're going right into the 50 backstroke for women's final final thank thank god i want to get to this 4 a.m yeah let's go let's go this is a final okay let's give it the respect it deserves this is a final who are we picking here Uh, always hansen's hot kylie mass is always there i'm going kylie mass yeah i'm going kylie mass i think mcneil's already had a, a race or two in this session so they all have yeah, Louise Hansen. Oh, wait, they're all here. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Oh, we're racing. Here we go. Who's it? Who's in three? Oh, McNeil. Aggie. Oh, McNeil's going to win this. It's game over. Mm, she had a great start. Wow. Oh, her underwater's a filthy. What? Absolutely killed it. Maggie McNeil. Oh, world champion oh. backstroker and world champion. Oh, no, fire. no, world oh, record how? holder, a world record holder. That's oh my is. god, she smashed it. She's a world record holder. What three tenths of a sec? Where did that come from? What a turn Under- underwater, underwater, what a turn, dude. Just dirty underwaters. Woo, that was sick. World record number two. Unbelievable. Boom, boom. Oh, loves it too. She can see it. that one. Wow. Just destroyed that field. She's an underwater freak, man. Absolutely perfect underwater turn. The breakout was perfect. Yeah. Yeah. I want to watch this again. That was money. Looked like she had fins on. Wow. Uh, Roddy agreed with you there, Nate. Oh, yeah. So what did he say? The breakout was perfect. It was ridiculous. Twenty-five two seven. That I mean, it's a That's demolish. It. That is insane. Kara Tucson. Twenty-five oh. six zero. Kylie Moss, by the way, only two Kylie Moss. Off that old world record. Yeah, she almost mm-hmm. took it. She almost took that. Yeah. Louise has for the third. So good. It looks like she's got fins on. She just smokes underwater. Oh yeah. By the way, Canada won too. Well, that's right. Beliefs. That's right. She's quite small too, right? She's, she looks kind of. I don't think she's like it's, tiny. She's um, not tiny, no. She's very strong. All right, that was that was fun. <laughs> I love these fifties, dude. They're the best. What is she saying? Let's listen to her. Got that fifty grand. It is, yeah. Give me that check, grand. baby. Oh, yeah. Woo! I'm with you, man. Give me a bag of cash. Swim right there, dude. Shaban Hahi, Maggie McNeil, both getting going home with sixty-five thousand dollars checks for races. Man, you'll never so make sixty-five thousand dollars uh, in in. Faster than 25.27 seconds, I'll tell you that much. Divide that in your hourly pay rate. A big boy check. Where does, um, who, do, who does, uh, um, who got second there? Where does she, where's she train? Kylie Moss. Yeah, where's Kylie Moss? Who, who coaches her? Who coaches Kylie Moss? Not Ben Titley. It's not. I don't know. Um, Is it? I don't know. She's from Windsor, right? So she came from Windsor Aquatic Club. I know that much because she won world championships in 2016. That was like her first breakout, I think, mm-hmm. when it was in Windsor. And they kept saying, mm-hmm. uh, hometown girl, hometown girl. You know, the city right across the from Detroit. It's literally, right. it's, it's like a, it's, it's like across Detroit the road. suburbs. Yeah. Yeah. I have a question here, Brett. Did you talk to Dressel while and I? I don't have. I uh, I shook his hand, said hello. Um, said did the same thing to his wife. 
just paid my respects. It was actually during one of the meets I ran into him. Uh, the meet was going on, so I, I, yeah, I wasn't there to chit chat. Just said hi. So that was it. Let him be, do his thing. All right, we got a, we have a tiny break here, and then the, then the, the big race. Oh, the big one. <clears throat> Um, yeah, let me pull up the uh 4 am heat sheet here for you guys. Yeah, they're hyping up this race too, big time with uh Seto and Foster. Uh, they should. Yeah, it was really cool. close. Two hundred IM, like yep. months apart. Um, yeah, this is gonna be good. Uh, I think Carson's gonna be able to split a fifty-four coming home. You heard it here first. So you said uh, the uh, Russian guy, Barodin, he he didn't he swam pretty fast recently too, right? He won European Championships in early November. He went three fifty eight. Okay, and he's just good at all the strokes. He doesn't have like one crazy fast stroke. He just is really good at them all. Four hundred IM. Four hundred I am. Carson Foster, hey. Huh? Oh, what's his teammate term? True. All right, we got a clip time. Clip, quick. Someone's got to win these races, and the gun is going to go at 7.05 mm -hmm. on one day every four years, an Olympic venue with 13,000 people there, a billion people watching on TV, commentators telling every move. You know, you can throw anything into that pot in descriptive words, words and it just ratchets it up, you know. And if you're not ready to go because you've done the brutal work and uncompromising work and training, you will fail. The quicksand will start as soon as you get your accreditation. It'll pick up speed. And then by the time you get to the blocks, you'll sit there going, what am I doing here? And you're not ready. Meanwhile, you've got a Gary or Junior standing there, or you've got a Beyondy standing there, you've got a Gross standing there. Oh, God help you if you've got a Phelps standing there. Mm. <laughs> and then all of a sudden, and you look over to him, and he looks like, mate, this is where I holiday. This is how much fun this is. Mm -hmm. And you sit there going, I'm done. And you're done, you know, because the moment that sort of creeps in, if you're not walking out on deck going, you guys are so sorry you're here. You know what I mean? Looking left and right, you lose. Great clip. Ah, great clip. Be in your own lane, man. Swim your own race. Jack Roach, ready? Ready for Jack Roach? Do it on the red, but I'll listen. Tell his <laughs> Jack. I tried to pull Jack in here. He said he's on the road. But Who, Jack Roach? You. Yeah, we love you, Jack. Be safe out there. He's listening. I tried to pull him in for the 400 IM, but he didn't take the bait. He's on the road. I saw some ad. I'm trying to pull someone in for 400 IM from Texas. Who could we get in from Texas? Anyone out there? Texas? He's going to kill sub four, bud. Oh, you know who we could get? What's his name? Austin. Where's Austin?
He's gonna he's gonna kill. Yeah, he's gonna. Yeah, and Smith is in this event too. Kind of yep. all forgot about him. No one's really talking about him. Lane two. They're doing a bit of a buy on him. Oh yeah, he's killing the cello or the yeah something. Cello. Question from SB. What was my strategy? Was I nervous? Absolutely nervous. Yeah. I mean, you're dealing with hundreds of seconds, you know, in most of these races, even this 400 IM is going to come down to hundreds of seconds, you know? So are you nervous? Yeah. Like you want your best performance on the biggest day. It's the world championships today. They're not, they're not postponing the event because uh, Kieran Smith isn't ready to race today. You know, it's like, let's go baby. So yeah, are you nervous? Of course you are. You're nervous as hell. You got to race the best in the world for a world title, which could ultimately change your future in some way because you're now you're going to be a world champion. So there's a lot riding on it for these swimmers, you know. And um, you know, a lot of funding goes into this, a lot of sponsorship dollars here. So individually, there's a lot at stake. So you don't get many shots at a world title. So like right here, we're in the ready room. Are these guys nervous? Yeah, they're nervous. They know they're racing seven other guys in this room that are just as good as them so i think it's a just an anticipation but what you just come back to is your training you know what have you done to get there so it's the only thing you can focus on this is going to be a cracking race right here cracking race Here we go. Brandon Almeida, he's always he's always in and around there. Mm -hmm. The Brazilian kid. Yeah, he's always up and around there. Yeah, made another final. Oh, and uh, Eaton from Israel in lane one. He, uh... There's Eaton getting his 50 kick on. 50 kick challenge still open 11 more days i got it i'm coming up on wednesday two two more days are oh, you doing it uh, yep. aaron 100 percent, dude dan kowalski's interview is one of the best uh that brett's ever done it was it was good yeah i pushed i pushed hard on that one yeah i went in, i went in deep on that one yeah you did sometimes i push hard on them you know because i know what's really there 15 15 from a push kowalski yeah. yeah he's good an animal all right guys i'm getting pumped for this one foster yeah this is gonna come down to it man this is gonna be foster I think it's gonna be a rundown of seto like yeah. they're gonna have to catch him yeah it's those two boys foster and seto well, it's Carson gonna Foster's going to have to come home for sure. Yeah. I mean, Diaceto usually goes out. He's just like he's pretty even it. all the way. Yeah. He just puts so much pressure on you from the very beginning. Kuzarowski was a good interview, too. Trying to get Sato on the podcast. We're going we're gonna to try and get a translator for him. Got to get this young Russian kid, too, man. He's awesome. Rodin. 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 Yeah, he's great. Sato is just a little pocket rocket, isn't he? We got another Italian in there, too. Rossetti. Turner, Turner fly? He got second at Euros. This kid, this Italian didn't even bother shaving down for this one. He's like, forget that. Carson Foster with that Mizuno on. Racing. Oh, gosh. Nerves are gone now. Now it's just time to race. Here we go. Hopefully, these guys are just in a flow state. If they're thinking too much here, then it really messes with your flow. So hopefully there's just a, a flow state going on here. You, just you kinda, definitely got you got to swim your own race. Yeah. yeah just, oh, just letting it letting it come out. Uh when you, I'm rewatching the 2010 4 IM when Lochte went 355 and Tyler Clary, man, he just Lochte just let him let him go out. He knew what he's doing and then just crushed the breaststroke. That was when Lochte's breaststroke never looked so good. Hmm. 
That year, I think he won the Hunter Breaststroke that year, didn't he? 2010? Maybe. Carson Foster with a long fly wall there. Didn't love that wall. I thought that was Seto with the long wall. Oh, Seto is just clean, man. He's in and out. Carson Foster that. about uh, half a body length behind. 1.04 seconds behind Seto. But Rodin... Uh, just a couple tenths after the fly behind Carson Foster. So here we go. Guys, See how they – I love how they hold their lines off their walls there. See how they hold their yeah. lines and yeah. then they get into their kicks? Man, that's it's hard to teach that, the patience of that. It's so beautiful when they do it right. What and the timing on it is so crucial too, I think. Yeah, Holding look at Sato. He it. really holds his extra line. Yeah, he just holds it, man. Just hold the line, guys. Such a teaching opportunity right there, learning. There you hold, kick, right. kick, kick. Up. Come on, Carson. Don't let him get too far away from you here. Man, his de – like uh, Sato's details, I think, on every stroke are pretty pretty spot on. I mean, you can't fault him too much really at all. Dude, he just, cr he just negative split this backstroke, I'm telling you. Yep. What an – he just took off from Carson. Look at that line he holds on his go. breaststroke. Go get him, baby. Yeah, high just... hips. Those hands are just sitting on top of the water. He's pulling away from Carson. He's not. Carson oh, ain't no. catching him. He's pulling away. Sato's pulling away. It's all his lines. Look at his lines off his walls. Dang, they're Insane. just spot on. Yeah. <sighs> yeah, he's going to have to work hard to try. Make oh up no! That room. Oh, yeah. it's game over, guys. This is this is all Sato. Coley Stickles, a little bit of love mm, on the Carson back end Foster, here. 2.3 seconds behind. Ilya, 3.3 seconds behind. Oh, oh, he's gone. No, it's over. He gone. Foster better hurry up for this uh, bronze medal here. Yeah, the Russians, the Russians coming up there too, having a good breaststroke leg. Yeah, Broden. Broden's coming at him. Come on, Carson. Yeah, he needs to come on. Come on, Carson. Got to get that freestyle leg together now. Come on. Seto, 257 9. Oh, Just Broden. over a second slower than his Broden's own world got record. Freestyle. Broden's coming at all of them. He's hungry. The Russian wants some of this. Yeah, the Russian's murdering home. Great, great, great battle. Too. Great battle between. Uh, Carson and Baroden. But Baroden's really digging in. Mm. I'm moving. Oh, man. wow. He's coming he's up fast. on him. He's coming up. Uh, wow. Bad turn by Sato. Great finish. Oh, oh double man. J. Come on, oh, Carson. Come on, Carson. Well, junior record. Oh, oh. Wow. Yeah. What a kick. Oh, he almost gets him, dude. Sata. Baroden. Well, junior record there. Disgusting back end. Yeah. Broden. That last 100 was amazing. Well, the uh, 356.26. Yeah, not far off the world record, really. I mean, not far off the championship record. I mean, he crushed the world junior record, Baroden. Yeah, what, two and a half seconds, three seconds? Oh, geez, just crushed it. I'm curious what his uh, last 100 split on that freestyle was because he was... 28-3-2, 28-3, 26-4. 26-4 at the back five, end. mid, low. It's legit. It didn't look like it had swum 300 meters of fast swimming before that. The Hungarian who didn't shave down just went 4 11. That's it. That's it. All 25 meters behind. It's all Sado right now. Oh, Sado's world. We just live in it. All right. 54 8. Wow. My friends, I'm going to go do some work. It's been 54, fun. 54 8. Is that what you said? Yeah, 54 8 on. 
Uh, Hell yeah. Yeah. 56, 57. Yep. Pretty damn good race there. Four guys under four minutes. You know who we're missing too was Brendan Smith mm. from Australia. Yeah. 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 All, right. All right. Well, we'll keep skipping, uh, we'll keep cutting out a little early here, but um, enjoy the women's 100 uh, breaststroke, followed up by. Uh, the relay. What, a relay? What relay is it? It's four, four by two. Four by two women's. We we missed a awesome four by two men's <laughs> with America. Oh, that was ripping yeah. it up. Lane one again, taking Killing that goal, man. Unbelievable swims from everybody. Yeah. All right, we're out. We'll be back tomorrow. Final day. Sponsors at the top. Don't forget to give them some love. How old is Burrowed? And I think he's nineteen. Podcast out today. Or no, maybe he's eighteen. Aquavolo. Aquavolo. Yep, 18. See ya. Simeon.